There is um, a common misconception, probably as a result of the way inclusion is often done in the workplace, that inclusion is about um, a power imbalance where one uh, majority group um, or senior person invites somebody else to the table, yeah. that it's a kind of a, a bestowed um, privilege, I suppose. So the way that I like to explain this is uh, by talking about a packet of crisps. Um, Say you've got a packet of crisps and somebody's with you and they don't have a packet of crisps. So you might say, oh, would you like a crisp? And they say, oh, yes, please. So you open your packet and, well, if you're, if you're one of my children, he would do this. He'd look in the and think, oh, well, oh, that one's a bit big. So I think I'll keep that one. That one's covered in uh, prawn cocktail flavouring, so I'm definitely keeping that one. So you may have this crisp. Um, and in his mind, he's shared. Uh, he's been really, you know, sh sharing the uh, crispy wealth. Um, but actually, as the person on the receiver again, it's like, oh, thanks. He's held all the power. He's held all the crisps. Um, you might uh, get to a stage of somebody saying, oh, you know, would you like one of my crisps? Help yourself. And there's something there that's a bit more um, willing to give up power and space um, and say, you know, take what you take what you want. But actually, you're still holding the packet. Um, when um, I go to the pub or a cafe and I buy a packet of crisps, I tend to bite it open and open the packet out and put it on the table in the middle and just say, I'll help yourselves. But they're still my crisps. I bought them. Give. Now, inclusion is what we in the Midlands called, call a fuddle. Maybe that's just an East Midlands thing. A fuddle. A food muddle. A fuddle is where everybody brings something different to the table. And actually, if you're having, if you're having a fuddle and everybody brings a tub of coleslaw, that's not going to be a very good meal. And when we do fuddles, we're really excited about what other people are going to bring to the table because it's going to be different from what we bring to the table. And it's not about kind of benevolently bestowing space and power on somebody. It's about being genuinely, authentically excited about what that person can bring and knowing in your inner core that that table will be nowhere near as good if that person doesn't bring what they've got to bring. Like, you know, the, I'm, a, I'm a linguist by training. The word platform is one that's always kind of really struck me. That root plat means flat. A platform is a flat place. It's a flat place where anyone can walk on and anyone can have a voice. And actually, the more diversity we have in that space, the better it is. Like our fuddle, when we don't have 12 quiches, we have, you know, a brilliant array of, um, you know, different bits and pieces. And you can enjoy sharing in those things and have a much better experience because of it. So for me, inclusion, it's about valuing difference because it makes us all better and whilst that does require shifting up and making space we do that gladly and willingly because other people coming in are bestowing on us the you know the richness and, and innovation and creativity of the diversity that they bring.